I recently just got an email, and it is the scariest thing I've ever seen. Because it's open note, you already know this is about to be the most diabolical thing you've ever seen. But Ziki, does an open note mean you get more stuff to look at and you can know all the answers? No. What it actually means is that the test is going to be so hard that not even the textbook can save you and we're probably going to talk about some questions that the professor was asked during his PhD defense. If you don't go into the test knowing that you could rewrite the book from start to finish, you're probably screwed. Because if you forget something, well, going back in the textbook won't really help because it'll probably take you 30 minutes to figure out what they're talking about and then maybe you'll have a chance to solve the question. Oh, scratch that, you flip to the next question and realize you have no clue what's going on there either. So you just end up studying the whole book from start to finish and then bring the book for backup, but odds are either one, you'll either be too well prepared, won't even need the book, great, or two, you're fucked anyways. My old strategy for open note was actually to just write down all my homework answers on a piece of paper and also pass tests if they have that. And I would just go off that and hope it works. Except this time, for the new content, we haven't been test on it, and also our homework hasn't been graded because our TAs are on strike, cause yeah. So I don't even know if what I'm doing is right or not, and there's no answers because Chegg is always wrong, chat GPT is always wrong, and the professor is like adios to another college every like other day or something. Okay, well, instead of making this video, I'm going to start to go actually study for it, and yeah, wish me luck. Hope I don't die.